Hey what's up guys, Josh here from iTech Everything and in this video I'll be unboxing this, the new white and silver 128GB iPad Air 2. Let's get started. Alright guys, so as I just said, this is the new iPad Air 2 white and silver. This is the 128GB model with 4G, so it's top of the line. Here in Australia this goes for $1,019. And over in America, it goes for $829. And if you're in the States and you want to buy anything on Amazon, go ahead and use my link in the video description to support the channel. Thank you very much. Now, let's get right into the iPad. Make a few incisions here. With my handy dandy unboxing knife. There we go. And here we go. Here is the new iPad Air 2. As you can see, there's the Touch ID sensor right there. We'll go ahead and put that off to the side for just a moment. In the box, as always, we have the charger right there, designed by Apple in California booklets, as always. And under the booklets, we have the lightning cable. Opening up the booklet, there we have the SIM eject tool. Very interesting, so in the instruction manual it actually just says iPad Air, it does not say iPad Air 2, interestingly enough. And of course we got our two Apple stickers. Let's go ahead and peel off that plastic, like so. And on first impressions, it definitely does feel quite light in the hand for the size of the tablet. Let's go ahead and give you a tour of the device. Up front we have our new and improved FaceTime camera. On the bottom right there, the Touch ID sensor. On the bottom we have the lightning port and speakers. On the left hand side, absolutely nothing. On the right hand side we have our volume up and down. And down the bottom on the right side we have our nano SIM tray. On the back, we have our new and improved EyeSight camera, which is 8 megapixels. I believe this camera is the same as the 5S. It's not quite as good as the 6 and 6 Plus camera. And there are our dual microphones, one there and one there. And because this is the 4G model, we have the piece of plastic here to allow the radios to go through the iPad. Up top, we have our 3.5mm headphone jack and power button is still on the top. Apple did not move it to the right side uh, as they did with the new iPhones. And of course we have our shiny Apple logo. So that's about it for this video guys. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter over at twitter.com forward slash iTech everything. Drop a comment down below. Are you getting the new iPad Air 2 or are you going for the somewhat disappointing new iPad mini? Go and follow me on Twitter over at twitter.com forward slash iTechEverything, and I'll see you guys in the next one.